Last year, I made about $40,000 on a separate business just by doing keyword optimization on my website. This is a, a practice the SEO experts called keyword research. So the idea is if you know what things people are searching for on Google and you know those terms exactly, then you can optimize your website. Now, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how I figured out how to do the exact same thing for your Upwork profile. So let me walk you through this, right? So I have a client right now. He's enrolled in the, this uh, Upwork automation lead gen service that I have, and he does Klaviyo stuff or Klaviyo, right? And one of the things you'll notice if you do any search for anything on Upwork is there's many different skills that people use in the job posting. Now, I've seen some YouTube gurus and they say this is like the number one thing you have to optimize in your profile to make sure that you get invitations and people like watch, like send you invitations for jobs. So the thing you'll notice is there's lots of different ones. So you have Clavio, right? But then you have campaign management and email automation, active campaign, it's not even you know relevant here. Uh, this one's got graphic design, email marketing. So you know email marketing is not up here. There's a bunch of different stuff here. So how do you know? This is Figma, Canva, this one has Shopify. How do you know what skills are the most common? Now you could guess if you if you wanted to, but I'm gonna show you how to find every, literally every single keyword anybody has ever used. And uh, this is something I'm really, really excited about to include in my Upworks automation, uh, Legion automation service. But I'm going to walk you through exactly how I figure this out so you can do the same if you want to and you know how it works. So the first thing we do is we use the RSS from Upwork to get a feed of all the jobs. And then that goes into Airtable, right? So we parse out the title and the description and the budget and these things. And we also get the skills list. So this is all, this is every, this is a bunch of different jobs that are all Clavio jobs, right? We see the skills in this column here. Now, the next thing we do, once you have the skills separately from the other one, and again, if you don't wanna do this, like you could go through and copy paste all of these if you really, really, really want to but I'm guessing you don't want to have to go through and like copy all this, right? I'm gonna show you the faster way of doing it. So we go through, we have the, the skills list, right? So we're gonna start at the top and then go all, we've been collecting data for months now. So we have this, we're gonna copy all this data and we're gonna put it into regex101.com. So uh, I will give you this regular expression, I'll put it in the, in the YouTube description but uh, a regular expression allows you to extract text from other text, basically. So over here on the, on the side here, you're gonna click this export matches button and click on plain text and then uncheck this box. Now you have a whole bunch of stuff, right? Copy that and then you're gonna go into Google Sheets, paste that and then use unique A colon A to get only the unique values because there's lots of repetition in this first column here, right? Now, with this data here, let's see how many we have. There's so much stuff here, okay. So we have 571 unique skills that anybody has ever used for any job on Upwork in the last couple, like several months here for a Klaviyo job. So the next thing we're gonna do Oh, we need to do edit, paste special values. Okay, now we've got the actual values. And what you may wanna do is go through and just figure out which ones are relevant for you. So again, the, I'm not gonna go through this process, but you can see what's really, really interesting about this is we have a lot of different skills that you, would not, you wouldn't necessarily expect to include in a profile, but if you, I guarantee you, if you put every single skill, either as a skill in your profile or in your like bio description thing, or maybe as like a separate product or service that you offer in Upwork, you will get noticed by more searches and more you'll get more invitations because you're actually including the exact skills that people are using for your niche. So, right, we see uh, you know that one probably not the academic one. Um, Ad copy, yeah, maybe active campaign. Uh, if you do like graphics, maybe it's like the Adobe stuff, right? Advertising design. 
you can see there's a huge, there's 500 job, or, uh, uh, skills here, right? So for your niche, whatever your niche is, you would follow this exact same process. You'd go through, you identify the, the relevant skills, and then you would go and add them either as a skill or in the, the copy of your profile, or you you create a separate product or service uh, on Upwork to make sure that your profile is fully optimized. I kid you not, I was shocked at how effective SEO was for my website when I hired an SEO age, a very good SEO agency for my website. And unfortunately, until now, there wasn't really a way to do keyword research for Upwork, but this is how you do it. So. I have a up, an automated Upwork lead gen service. So you come to me, you say, hey, Ryan, I, I wanna target Klaviyo, you know, I do email copy, whatever, I do graphic design, I wanna do TikTok videos, right? And I will configure the searches for you, make sure that it's all optimized. You get alerts when there's relevant jobs, and then also as part of that service, I will include the skills in the profile uh, like the keyword research, right? As we gather data, we get all the skills. So that will all be included. If you are interested in that, if you are a business doing probably at least five to 10 K per month already from other sources, and you want to either expand Upwork as a lead gen source, or you want to add Upwork to your existing marketing channels, let me know. You can hit me up on Twitter. You can leave a comment below. I will leave my email below as well. You can book a call with me to discuss that. But uh, if you if that is not in your budget, you can feel free to steal this entire system by following this exact procedure. So I will include the regular expression down below. You guys can check out regex101.com. It's a really cool site. And that is all for today.